Talk about your big sad. Hey, what's up everybody? Welcome back to World of Warcraft. It's me, Morvar. How you doing? Uh, so... <laughs> it's been a while since I've done an episode. And there's a perfectly good reason for that. Uh, it wasn't because of life. It was because of my own, for lack of a better word, stupidity. I did a small brain move. I did a... Snafu, if you will. Uh, so, the way... Basically what happened was that I recorded a very long episode uh, last, last time I recorded. And without going into too much detail, basically the video was edited, rendered, and everything. And it got deleted. Gone. Poof. Uh, shebang. It's gone. So, real quick here, before we move on with today's episode, uh, we're going to go ahead and I'm going to run you through really quick uh, what we did between, uh, between the last quote-unquote episode and uh, what I did in between episodes. So, sit back, relax, and enjoy the, the quickness. We added on to this. We built this. We did interior work, right here, here, and here. I built this in between episodes. Well, uh, I technically built it last air quote episode, but uh, I added the barrels here because we got some cool enchanted stuff. We also built this, like this entire room, and I got lots of really neat stuff. And lastly, the most notable thing that I did was I made like this kind of artificial stream here. Uh, I'm planning on doing some more stuff with it, but I kind of felt like just making a, a, a water stream here. I don't know why. Uh, I felt like it really needed it. Uh, the water mechanics are still kind of weird, but we'll work on that some more uh, another time. So anyway, uh, moving on. Uh, today guys, I kind of have like a few things I want to start doing. Uh, I want to, uh, I want to make a little boathouse. Uh, I think that'd be really cool. And I also want to kind of do some odd jobs around the base because I'm really digging like this modular design that we're going for. I think it's really kind of coming together a little bit. Uh, there's definitely like kind of like a shift in... <laughs> build quality uh, from where we first started to about right here. Although this is a little bit better than what I normally do. Uh, I Or a little bit better than what I've been doing. You know, it's still got a long ways to go. Uh, I've never been like the most talented builder, but I've definitely loved, I've definitely always loved building. Uh, oh yeah, the other purpose for this artificial river was the, the uh, sugar cane farm that we have going there, but eventually we're going to hook all that up to redstone. Uh, but I want to kind of branch out a little bit eventually. Uh, like I want to add, I need to put a pressure plate there. Uh, what I eventually want to do is, uh, I want to kind of have like a more like expansive sort of living area. Like, I want to, I want to make this area look nice. Like, I want to do, like, some various, like, projects around here. And just kind of, you know, just make the place more homely, you know? Just more homely. And, let me go put this right here. I don't know why it's taking me so long to put a pressure plate there. But, uh, I never put one on the outside because, because, you know, mobs... <laughs> <laughs> and I really hate to get like a butt stabbed by a by a skele bones. That would not be ideal at all. But uh, yeah, I kind of want to do like a few little a few little things. Uh, let me take a trip to my storage room. We collected so much stuff. Like it's been so long since I've actually played with enchanted tools. But uh, I've got. I mean, just all kinds of good stuff. Like, I poured every single level I had <laughs> into getting these tools. Because I don't even know how much XP I had. So, 
I, I end up collecting so much material that I end up having to move the coal, redstone, and lapis into these barrels here. Just because, like, this double chest is is not going to cut it. But, um, hmm. So, I want to do something. Actually, I want to check on just how much. Okay, so we have some oak wood here. So, that's cool. Uh, I'm trying to think of a good spot for the boathouse. Because we travel a lot by boat, so I think it's going to be, uh... I think it'll be pretty ideal to kind of have one going. Uh, probably gonna need some stone, I think. But we don't appear to have a whole lot. No, we do not. Hmm. So, I think we're gonna go ahead and pick a location. And I might actually have some more stone somewhere in the outside chest. Oh, and I also kind of made like a little derpy kitchen here. Uh, smoker, chest, crafting table, pretty basic. But, anyway. Uh, I also want to eventually... I don't like the way this looks. Like, I want to kind of maybe extend this hill out a little bit because we have plenty of dirt from uh, doing the artificial river. But uh, I want to kind of expand out this hill just a little bit to like maybe like right there ish and then uh and then make it like a gradual pathway up to the front door well, I think that would be pretty cool and a skeleton died so that's always nice uh oh speaking of skeleton we also have a skeleton spawner uh down in the depths of the uh of the strip mine that I I started building. Okay, so location for this. Wow, my frames are skipping quite a bit. I don't know what's going on there. Uh, so location uh, for the boathouse. I think. I think what's gonna end up happening is that I might end up building multiples of these. So I may keep the design sort of simple. Uh, just because. I don't know. Whenever I get into a boat, I just want to go in, like, one direction instead of, like, you know, just everywhere. Because that way I don't get lost as easy. <laughs> but, uh, anyway. So, I want to kind of build one out right here. Because I've discovered that there is a massive jungle off that way. And I'm going to be pillaging it for all its glory soon enough. But, uh, we want kind of a sort of simple kind of dock design uh, we're gonna have the front door like maybe like right here it well actually let's put the frame right here and then we'll just say for the sake of example that the the front door will go right there cool so and then from there we're gonna go and I really should grab more blocks. Alright, so back to what we were doing. Uh, I want to kind of go like this. Have an extension. And this and this little area, like I'll have it like kind of cordoned off here. Uh, let me put a log right here just to kind of mark where I'm at. But yeah, like I'll make like a square here and then the like this will be like the main area like where I can store like boats and whatever. Uh, speaking of boats, uh, one of my biggest pet peeves about recent additions to the game is that they changed how boats work so much. I was I had like this idea that that uh, I would be able to go into a boathouse and hit a dispenser and then. A boat would be deployed right in front of me. I mean, I thought that would be really cool. Apparently, that's not how boats work anymore. And I tried every possible, every possible uh, thing that I could have ever thought of, and nothing seems to work. Oh, sneezes. Anyway, so yeah, boats have changed quite a bit. All right, so we want. 
Uh, actually, let's do... Maybe, like, brick. Or, not brick, but, uh... Uh, planks. There we go. Planks. That's the word I need. Uh, right here. And this won't be, like, anything, like, fancy. This will just be, like, if we want to... Ooh, you know what we could do is, like, have, like, a, a little spot where we can just, like, sit and, like, go fishing. Uh, I need to see if minecarts actually work like chairs. That would be really cool. Like, have, like, a nice little spot, like, where I can sit in a minecart and just kind of AFK and, like, fish right here. That would be sweet, wouldn't it? Anyway. <laughs> So, I think I kind of want, hmm, what do I want for the, I think I kind, I don't want anything like super like heavy looking, because it wouldn't really make a whole lot of sense if I had like such a heavy boathouse, I mean, applying logic to a video game here, but, uh, <laughs> but, you know, if you have, like, a, a, a building that's too heavy, like, built on, like, wood logs like this, it would just sink, right? So, hmm. Maybe, if I did... Hmm. Okay, so let's just, for right now, for the sake of demonstration, let's just extend these out just to see how tall we're gonna make this. I don't want I don't want it to be like super fancy because like I said I'm probably gonna end up having to replicate this design a few times because you know why do it once whenever you can do it a bunch of times. <laughs> and the way I design the way I envisioned this kind of working is that there would be like a little area right here like this will be like the central hub and then the there would be like a dock and then there would be like a fence gate or something like that that would go that would lead right out into that direction or something that'd be really cool let me go sleep and we'll figure this out all right so we're back and let's make a door or two or three as a as it gave me and i like putting my doors on the inside yeah that looks nice Okay, so kind of what I want to do is, I think, I want this to kind of look sort of old school, you know what I mean? Uh, so what I'm going to do is, I'm going to place it like that, and then I want to actually make some fences. And instead of windows, we're going to use fences for, to fill the empty gaps. I think that'd be really cool. I believe it's like, oh no, that's the gate. <laughs> so it's, it's like this? Yeah, all right. So we're gonna make a couple of those, or a couple of sets of those, I should say. And, Hmm. Doesn't quite look how I want. You know, what if we did stone brick fences? Or not fences, but what are they called? Uh, how are those even made? I don't remember exactly how you make the walls. Ah, okay. So let's get sick of those. It's looking a little flat. A little flat, not gonna lie. Hmm. Also, it kind of looks weird with the, uh... Oh, that's weird. <laughs> it's like, it's like the wall's, like, connecting to the door, like, as it opens. That's weird. Okay. So I think we should do something about the how flat it looks. So maybe if I did something like this. 
kind of give it a little bit more flair. Why add that? I don't know. Because it because I'm just trying stuff out. <laughs> eh, that looks okay, but that's not great. It's not great. So I think we're gonna leave those fences right there because I kind of like how I kind of like how that looks. Now, the roof is an entirely different animal because roof is hard on the world of Fwedge. Roof takes big brain maneuvers. And that kind of goes against like what I was saying earlier about it looking heavy. But let's just let's just for the sake of seeing how things work try it out. So we're gonna put like that. I think I did that wrong. Yeah, I did. <laughs> Oops. I need to look up how to make scaffolding is what I need to do. So we got that. And let's do this again. I probably should have uh, used the, the, uh, the stone cutter thingy for this because... It's a lot cheaper and a lot more resource friendly, but you know, I don't really, as we've uh, discussed earlier, I don't really use the big brain. Uh, that looks really kind of flat, so let's bring it out just a little bit. One of the things I want to do is eventually get better at building and I think this will be the perfect world to be able to do that okay okay that's looking okay that's looking all right so we want I should probably just put this in my hot bar like that that uh-huh yep mm-hmm sure and put torches everywhere because oh wait I have some <laughs> my uh my offhand oh I'm not good at this game guys <laughs> but uh eventually I want to add like lighting all throughout the all throughout Iron Island just because I hate mobsters so that'll be a project for another day for sure but torches all around the building area for now and plus mobs won't spawn like within 20 blocks of me anyway so it's not that big of a concern but still you never know all right cool that doesn't make conflict with the Thing. How will I bring that up one level? I wonder how that would look. Oh, good lord. That looks like hell over there. Alright, that's looking pretty okay. At least for right now. So, we want to do that to the other side here as well. Now, I just need to remember how I did it right here. And I'm a little nervous because there's a ton of, of creepy crawlies around, so... Mm. Alright, so... Right here for sure. Hello, Zambo. Bye, Zambo. Anyway. Okay. So that goes all the way out there. Okay. Isn't it funny at the end of the day that like all Minecraft players like end up just doing the same uh, doing the same builds they that they always do over and over again, just different <laughs> versions of it. Anyway, oop, that's not right. So, uh huh. 
Yeah. Mm-hmm. No, that's not good. Not good at all. Uh, one thing that I've noticed is that we don't... I haven't really found a guardian farm, and I or a guardian uh, temple. I really want to figure out how to build a guardian farm because I really like uh, Prismarine. And that'd be really cool to have for the base. Alright. So we got that uh, going. So I'm going to go ahead and finish the roof and hopefully not die. And then I'll see you back in a few minutes. Mm-hmm. So, I finished the roof, guys, and, uh, I kind of had a problem with, with, uh, with closing off the, uh, the roof, the roof part, so what I did was that I just kind of made these last two blocks here, uh, the stone stairs, and it actually looks pretty okay. I'm not gonna lie, I really like how it looks. One thing I want to do is I want to build, like, kind of like a, <laughs> a nose for it, like, maybe go down one with that but yeah like a little nose thing and like have a lantern or something dangling from right there I think that'd be really cool but any hoozles uh, how does that look with uh, that looks weird so let's just put it right there how does this look yeah that looks weird but anyway so, what we're going to be doing now is finishing the walls and probably uh, add the little uh, the little ship dock. And that'll be basically this project wrapped. Alright, so wall time. So, here's what I kind of thought. So, we want to put some slabs right here. Get rid of this guy because he's not supposed to be there. And let's see. Okay, so I want to try this. See how this looks. And then maybe some right here. Okay, that's looking... Ooh, that's kind of trippy. <laughs> I kind of like that, I'm not going to lie. So let's go ahead and, oh, my frames are dropping, or not dropping, but they are just being a little, little crazy. But, oh, I need some more stone brick. But, oh, this is a bad time to go get some too. <laughs> eh. So, for now, <laughs> until I... I can guarantee my own safety. We're just gonna place this right here. And just leave it be for right now. And from here, like, we'll have, like, maybe, like, my, uh, like, fishing rods or something like that. But in any case, I do want to extend this out a little bit. have it go a little bit off to past shore and I kinda want to have like an old-school kinda dock look to it so what we're gonna do is we're gonna extend this out and we're gonna put some logs Kind of in the same kind of configuration as we have right here. And I need to close this off. This looks a little weird from right here. But in any case. Oh man, I need to make more stuff. <laughs> and I have materials, I just don't bring them all with me half the time. And place it like that. Mm hmm. And we have Zambos coming after us. Which one, Zambo? 
Oh, there's a, another one in there. He's about to turn into a drowned. Yep, there it is. These guys just sound so gross. But I'm not gonna lie, I kinda like the drowned as a, a mob. Not whenever they're throwing uh, tridents at me, that's not fun. But any hoozles. Extend this out. And I believe they can't spawn on slabs, but I think it's like whenever like the slabs are in a specific way. Different than what I have here, for sure. Alright, so how... Like, what's the distance between here and there? That looks like... Maybe one, two, three, four. So we're gonna go... I need dirt. My coffee tastes like dirt. Alright. Goodbye. Goodbye. So long. Farewell. A lot of you guys out tonight, huh? Anyway, we're just gonna ignore that. Three, four. And then... Log. That's that's gonna bother me. Oh, apparently there's a a log. God, gosh darn it! Can you go somewhere, guy? I'm probably gonna have to go in the water and actually place the dirt block for me to get the log on there. Good news is that I think he's the last one. Alright, so... Boom. Alright, that should make things a little easier for right now. And let's make this actually just... Like that. Swim me, swim me, swim me. Just keep swimming, just keep swimming. Yeah, the structure looks great if you don't look at it from underneath. <laughs> but if you look at it from underneath, you can definitely see some of my crimes. Some of my building sins, if you will. So, like that. Place you like there. Now, how far I want to go out with this, that is a question. Because I want this. Hmm. I have to do some thinky think about this because. I want to have it to where, like, I can press a dispenser, get a boat, and then just drop in here and, like, go, go, uh, like, uh, go boating. <laughs> but, oh, almost fell in there. That's not good. Let's not do that. Uh, maybe extend this out just a little bit more, I think. Because I want this to be far off enough to where if I wanted to just go out here and fish, that's not right. If I want to just go out here and fish, uh, I can. Or if I want to go boating, I can do that as well. But uh, I kind of wanted it to where like I could just run through, a uh, dispenser would, would trigger, I get a boat, and then like I would just like toss it there, boom, 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 three motions, and then you're already out to the sea. But I don't think I can really do that with this configuration. So I'd have to figure something out for that. But I definitely, for sure, want to extend this out maybe a few more blocks. Maybe enough to where like, I need another pillar. I think that would uh, be alright. And I need... I forgot to craft slabs. Because I'm a derp.
But, yeah, guys, uh, how are you guys liking these series so far? I'm definitely enjoying it. Uh, I'm definitely enjoying making it, because, like, you know, it kind of forces me to kind of get into a creative space, and I, I really like, I really like that, uh, I really like doing that. So it's, okay, one, two, three. Is it four in between, or f on the, okay. So yeah, it is four between, so one, two, three, four. Alright, so place... One right. Oh! Come here, saplings. There we go. Place one right here. And then the same for right here. And there we go. A nice little dock. Nothing fancy. I think I'll uh, add, like, maybe like a lamp post. Actually, that's a good idea. But I'll have to I'll have to put that off for another time because we are running uh we are running the clock. So anyway, guys, thank you guys for watching. Hope you enjoyed the episode. Thank you, thank you again for tuning in. And until next time, I'll see you later.